Binance coin is on fire. Over the last two weeks, it's up over 213%. And the reason is because people are starting to actually use Binance Smart Chain. And the native asset of this decentralized chain is BNB. And here's a tweet from CZ and he stated, congrats on flipping Sushi. Sushi is a decentralized exchange built on top of Ethereum. And all of a sudden we have PancakeSwap, which is a decentralized exchange built on Binance Smart Chain flipping Sushi. And this is a very big deal. We have been speaking about for years, the Ethereum killers. Now I'm not going to say that Binance Smart Chain is an Ethereum killer. But the funny thing is, it is the closest thing to it. A lot of these projects over the years that have been saying we are coming after Ethereum have not even come close to where Binance Coin is and Binance Chain is right now. And this is a very funny tweet. It says your ETH with this high gas fee, $260, and the guy she tells you not to worry about, BNB Binance Smart Chain. So in this video, I'm going to explain a little more about what Binance Smart Chain is and also how you can actually get started and use applications such as PancakeSwap. Let's get into it. Welcome aboard the Bitcoin Express. My name is Chase, let's get to it. This is a tweet from CZ on February 9th and he said, today is an important day. Binance Smart Chain flipped Ethereum on daily transactions. This validates the logic that low fees attracts more users and projects. So right now, most people are on Ethereum, but the problem is the gas fees are so high. To interact with a smart contract can cost $100, $200, even more. So people are looking for a place to go for cheaper fees. And if we go to dapradar.com, we can see that across all protocols, so not just within DeFi, gambling, exchanges, collectibles, all protocols, PancakeSwap is sitting number two in daily users over the last 24 hours. And if we look at volume over the last 24 hours, this is even more impressive. We can see at one and two Venus and Auto Farm, these are DeFi protocols built on top of Binance Smart Chain. Of course, this list is mostly filled with Ethereum, but then we also have PancakeSwap here. So already Binance Coin and Binance Chain has done something that a lot of these other projects have not done over the years. And I'm not gonna name any specific projects out there, but I think we all know what I'm trying to get at here. Now, in terms of these projects, we can see PancakeSwap here. And this one has been having very heavy usage over the last few days. And as we can see, the price of PancakeSwap cake token is up 34% just today. And over the last 14 days, 449% and over the last 30 days, over 1100%. This is insane, right? And this is similar to all these other Ethereum protocols. You go to pancakeswap.finance, you connect your wallet, and boom, you can start interacting. Now I'm gonna actually show you how you can get set up and start interacting with applications such as PancakeSwap. Using Binance Smart Chain is very similar to using Ethereum with just a few differences. The first thing we wanna do is get a MetaMask wallet. And if we already have a MetaMask wallet, you know how to use it. We can see that there are different networks. Over here on the top, we're on the Ethereum mainnet. But to interact with Binance Smart Chain, we need to add a custom RPC. So first step is go ahead and download a MetaMask wallet if you have not yet. If you don't know how to do this, I did make a very good tutorial. You can go ahead and watch that right now and learn. Now, let's say you have this wallet set up. Now we need to add this custom network. So I'm gonna leave a link below for these directions, but this is what we need over here, mainnet. We need to add this to our wallet. So if we click here on RPC URLs, it will bring us to this page and we're gonna copy this and come right back here. So here are our, direct, our directions. So let's go to MetaMask and we are going to add a network. So if we click on the top, add custom RPC, we'll have our network name. We can give this anything we want. We'll just call this Binance Smart Chain, new RPC URL. Then we'll have our chain ID. And if we look over here, 56, right? This is the chain ID. So put in 56. Currency symbol, optional, we'll put BNB, and then block explorer, right over here, we'll enter that. So now that we have everything set up, we just click save, and just like that, we are on the network. And just to confirm it, we can make sure that our address is legitimate. Again, just check up here. Right now we're on the mainnet, right now we are on Binance Smart Chain. Now if we copy our address, and we go to bscscan.com, this is a Binance Smart Chain Explorer, we could just paste that in there, 
and we can look at our wallet, just like we would do this with Etherscan, just to make sure it's valid. As we can see, of course, this is empty, but if this was a wallet with heavy usage, it would have all of our transactions, everything we are doing on the network. Once your wallet is set up, you can go to pancakeswap.finance, connect your wallet, and start interacting. It's very simple, similar to using Ethereum. And this is how it would work for any application built on top of Binance Smart Chain. And I do wanna say that this project, Binance Smart Chain, PancakeSwap, it's nothing special or revolutionary. It's very similar to what we have in Ethereum, but the value proposition here is that there are cheap fees, and that is a very important difference. So if we go to PancakeSwap, there are a lot of things you could do. It has a nice user interface. You can stake tokens in order to earn cake, right? Pancake, that's the PancakeSwap token. You can also play in the cake lottery and buy tickets with cake. Also, you can stake your cake and earn new tokens. And then the main one you can exchange, right? So again, you're at this exchange over here, this DeFi protocol, you connect your wallet and you can start swapping tokens. So if you wanna get some pancake swap, we can look for it over here, cake, and then we can start exchanging it. Now to get BNB onto this platform, you will have to create a Binance account buy BNB and send it to your wallet, right? So again, here is our address over here, copy address. So if you have Binance.com, Binance US, you go to the website, you buy some Binance coin, you take this address and you send it. And now you can start interacting. Now this video is just an introduction. I'm not going into depth here. And there are two reasons why. Number one, I am not a heavy user of Binance Smart Chain myself but many people have been asking me about this, so I decided to make this video as an introduction. Hopefully it helps you get started. And then number two, I encourage you guys to go out and test this. When it comes to DeFi, one of the best things you could do is actually go ahead and mess around with it. I made tutorials many, many months ago about Ethereum, DeFi, NFTs, and so on. And I told people, go ahead, mess around, buy some crypto kitties, just have some fun. But now that is obviously too expensive. It might cost you $200, $300 just to have fun. So right now when it comes to Binance Smart Chain, PancakeSwap, the fees are very cheap. So I definitely encourage you guys to go ahead and mess around with it. That is if you're interested. Like the video, subscribe to the channel. Thank you for listening and I'll see you next time.